Major crypto derivatives exchange BitMEX avoided solvency problems and managed to process all of its users' withdrawals on time to remain solvent and in operation after a recent crackdown by the United States legal system. So how did the custodian manage the fallout? As reported, BitMEX founders Arthur Hayes, Samuel Reed, and Ben Dello were charged with running an unregistered trading platform and multiple Bank Secrecy Act violations on October 1. Samuel Reed was arrested on the same day but later released on a US$5 million United States dollars appearance bond. After the indictment, the platform has seen a substantial drop in both open interest and balances held in its custody, and all three founders have stepped down from all executive management responsibilities at BitMEX's parent company 100X Group. As per the latest state of the network issue by crypto intelligence firm Coinmetrics, BitMEX uses a three of four keys multi-signature address for the cold storage of its customer funds, and the withdrawals are processed around 1 p.m. coordinated universal time on a daily basis. Three keys are owned by its three founders, while one so-called vanity key is generated to sign outgoing transactions. As such, only two of three signatures are needed for withdrawals from the platform. Knowing this, Coinmetrics said it was able to make an educated guess about the withdrawals after the crackdown. Note that BitMEX made four additional withdrawal batches between October 1 and 2. Presumably, the key A belonged to Samuel Reed, as it didn't sign on October 1, when he was in custody. The red dates mark additional off-schedule withdrawals that were made to reassure the BitMEX users. According to the analysis, it remains unknown whether the founder keys have already changed ownership since the publication of the fillings, but the fact that all three original founders stepped down from their executive roles may indicate that such transition has already happened. BitMEX is yet to respond to our earlier request for comment on the matter. Meanwhile, the derivatives exchange has lost approximately 4% of its market share, while its competitors have risen in popularity. Regardless, it is unlikely that market regulators will stop its crackdown with BitMEX, as more unregistered exchanges are likely to be indicted in the near future, which might lead to solvency problems at other crypto custodians, the report concluded. As the old adage goes, not your keys, not your coins. Underscore 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 learn more, SEC Commissioner Hester Pierce on BitMEX, DeFi and Token Safe Harbor BitMEX case might prompt a closer regulatory look into DeFi KuCoin hack shows key difference between altcoins and Bitcoin US banks offering crypto custody is, insanely, bullish and risky.